All right, I've had a few people ask me how I went about putting ITBs on my 2ZZ powered MR2 Spider, so I'm gonna go into it here. Yes, I did have to cut the firewall. As you can see, the filter does protrude a fair way into the cabin. I have designed a flange style manifold that matches the head to the ITBs and the filter is a two in one velocity stack with a filter setup. Under the foam there is a wire mesh so that holds everything together which uh, prevents them getting sucked into the intake. The flanges you can see there were also CNC custom made designed by myself to hold it all onto the ITBs. I am running BMW S1000RR uh, drive-by wire throttles. It's cold, uh, fed by a cold air feed from the side here. I had a fabricator do up all this uh, alloy piping and box. There's the throttles there. Factory intake tubes from BMW motorbike mated to the custom CNC flange. Here is the engine bay side of the cold air feed, which uh, hooks up quite nicely. I could do a bit more in the way of heat shielding, and it is fed from the left-hand side side duct. Again, could be cleaned up a bit to allow a bit more airflow, but it seems to do the job. Uh, currently driving at about a couple of degrees above ambient temp. It is uh, sectioned off from the engine bay with this high temperature silicon sheet, which seems to do a wonderful job keeping the engine uh, heat away. Uh, all enclosed there, all fabricated up. Uh, that is a removable box and mounts to the factory parcel shelf mounting. And it has a removable viewing window at the top. I've got the uh, steel there, but I do have a clear sheet that I can put over if I want to show off the stacks. A few additionals, a four into one custom made headers that I had a local uh, exhaust shop make up. They're pretty good, nice and free flowing. I have a 10 row universal front mount oil cooler, which seems to do the trick as well. All run by ECU master EMU black. And I'm running on 15 by 7.5 Koenig hypergrams running federal RSRs. And I've just recently put on some Prius aluminium uh, front brake calipers, which seem to do the job.